Uh, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Uh, now in this video, let us go for the next part after receive item enter bell. As the receive item, items. Uh, what is the purpose of receive item? Receive item is used only if you purchase if you purchase something, but you receive the goods only, not the bell. It means bell is not received yet or bell is not entered yet into the system. It means you receive only the item but not the invoice from the supplier side. So if you order something or if you purchase something but you receive the goods only, only the goods. Remember the difference. In this one you receive item along with the bill or along with the invoice but in this case you receive the item only. So if this is so click on this one. So click on this one. You see this window, this is a window for receive item or item received only, right? Let us say previously we ordered the goods uh, from one of our supplier by the name of Ali Gold. And it shows that there's a purchase order, say yes. Click on this one to be picked. It should be ticked properly. See, these were the items that we have order from uh, one of our supplier by the name of Ali Gold. The goods are received but the bill is not received yet. What is the effect of this one on the QuickBook? If you save this one, it will increase our account payable but bill will not be created for our supplier. It means there will be no bill for Ali Gold. but definitely when you go for the report and check the accounts so it show a balance of amount of this much. How much is the total amount? Two lakh eight thousand, right? Uh, two lakh eight thousand forty. So this two lakh eight thousand forty will be one of our account payable, but it will it will not be shown under the bill section for any girl. Why? Because we have not received the bill yet. Why? Because see, even if this one is unticked, bill received, it is unticked. Why it is unticked? Because we receive the item only. If you receive the item only, so you have to take this one, right? So let me remove this one from the list let us say this time we did not receive this one so please remove the amount so the total balance of the bill is to like eight thousand right save and close this one save and close now go for the vendor if you go for the vendor section window center see among the bills do we have any bill because of uh, illegal there is no bill but if you collect on the item received there is an amount of to like eight thousand under illegal right if you go for the report go for the report come down for vendor and account payable click on vendor balance and summary so then click on the illegal so you see a balance of two like eight thousand from illegal it means it is one of our account payable but it is not available under interbell why because we did not enter the bill yet because of this uh, this purchase right so this section is used only if we receive the item and rest of the thing is not received yet. If you use this option, it is compulsory that you have to use the second option as well. Enter bill for received, uh, for received item. This section is used only if this one is used first. It means first you have to receive item. Later on, if you receive the bill for those items, you have to enter a bill for that one. It means already we received the item, but bill were not received. Now we receive the bill because of those items which we have previously received the items. So let us say now we have received a bill from Aligal, so we have to enter a bill because of that one. So first of all, you have to select name of the vendor Aligal. There is a bill because of this one amount received to like eight thousand. How much was the balance? The balance is amount of to like eight thousand. So now once again you have to save it. Save and save and close. Yes. Now if you go for the vendor. And click on the bill. There is a bill because of what? Because of Ali. How much is the amount? Amount this much. If you click on the items, there is no more that. That one will not be any more available in this section, right? Why this is so? Because because we have entered the bill for that one. There is one more item remaining because of ABC. Let us receive this one as well. Click on the vendor, receive item, select ABC. There is a bill. There is an item only. Bill is not received yet. Now let us receive this one. Save and okay this one. Once again, if you go for the vendor section, 
if you click on the item there is no more why because for all bills for all bills we have received the item so nothing is remaining so this was the purpose of uh, receive item right so if you receive the item only but not the bill so you have to use the receive item but later on when you receive the item so you have to click on this one so this was the purpose of this three or four items purchase order once again to purchase something receive item and enter, in, and enter bill if the item and bills are received at the same time if only you receive the item you have to use this option uh, but later on when you receive the item you later on you receive the bill for those items you have to select on this one so this was the information regarding this section so next video inshallah we'll discuss about the inventory activity.